got to be some at least ballpark idea of like, hey, everything goes well, boy, we could start construction by this date, and maybe we got a new nuclear plant by this date. Yeah, I don't want to preempt anything that the federal government would do with this site. We've been generating nuclear power here for about 50 years. It's one of the most studied piece of properties in Canada. We regularly and routinely do environmental assessments and all kinds of assessments for, for the impact. So we're hoping to be able to get credit for a lot of those things already done. And if we can do that, the timeline would be significantly shortened. Uh, otherwise, we'll go through the process uh, with the federal government uh, and uh, we'll work through it in the best way we can. All right. And I know you weren't uh, per se here when there was the shutdown here, clearly, but I mean, I'm sure you've talked to employees that were here. I mean, what do you think it means to them? Yeah, I think it means a bright future for all the communities in, in Ontario. When you look at the addition of, of new plants here at this site, it's a stable, reliable, affordable source of electricity, which means energy security. And then with our economic footprint all throughout Ontario and Canada, it really means jobs, not only for the near term, but for the long term. They're good paying jobs that'll be here for a long, long time. We are a made in Canada solution with made in Canada products. And I know, again, it's not built yet, but if everything went according to plan, there would be three units here. Like, this isn't, ultimately, it's meant to replace, you know, what you have here. But, I mean, it, the idea is that three, all three units, all three sites could operate together. Oh, for sure. And we, we would look to permit for up to 4,800 megawatts. So with 4,800 megawatts, you know, you'll hear some people call it uh, Bruce C on site. We already have a Bruce A and a Bruce B. But we'll see how that process uh, unfolds, and we'll again we'll look to the full generation of about 4,800 megawatts through the permitting process. Sorry, 4,800 would be four reactors, roughly. Uh, roughly could yeah. be five. Could right? be five. Roughly. So ours are right now are about uh, eight, a little between eight and nine hundred a piece. Sure. So some could be a little, some could be a little smaller. It could also be small modular reactors. So nothing's off the table. But it, we're saying 4,800 megawatts in total. So we're looking to permit that amount of power generation for Ontario. All right, excellent.